Eight cards on one. Auto send and just stay overbuilt. Build two on round one, though, because I think they will fuck us. Okay? Just turn auto send on. Because, realistically, they're going to forget to build, and it's hard to predict when they're going to forget to build, right? And if they forget to build on wave four, even though they're really bad on that wave, or really good on that wave, they're still probably going to leak, right? We'll go up the we'll go up the ladder. We'll go up the ladder, so. And we'll keep rotating people in. Feel out of place here. Uh one of these things is not like the other. What's going on, Techo? I think the campaign is actually really good in this game compared to where it was. Everyone had lock and gate guard here. Everyone lock and gate guard. Welcome. And after that, uh, just only place gate guard. Place two on one. Forsaken OP for sure. Since they have fixed Mythium, should one of us just place one to purposely leak to give more time? No, 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 it's fine, it's fine. We, I just say build two, man. Just build two and we'll just... You can push to five if they send you a snail on one. Most likely. Math is hard. Juniper hard and gave up. Uh, we'll get through there, Techo. I'll show you the ways of uh, gate guard only. The most OP strategy in the game. Ready up. Let's go. They always snail, man. They always snail. Dirty little rat man. Sending snails on one. Tommy is definitely sussy. Yes. Make sure you have 300 value on, on next wave, though. For sure. And 300 value on wave 3, excuse me. Oh yeah, Tommy is definitely a snail abuser, man. Sussy. For sure. Well, don't test me. You know better. I will just ban you for that. Heresy. Of not building only snails. Every single one of them. Every single one of them forgot to build. Oh no. Oh no. Oh boy, oh boy, boy. I let the door sound. Okay, so they're gonna have probably sixty to send to us. Yeah, it's not looking great, Popo. We got unlucky a little bit. Let's see what they build. Do they forget to build again? Okay, all of them built like the same thing here. There is our 60. Do we all get fiend? We all got fiend. Um, I'm not doing too terrible here. Do I get this sp spawn out? Okay, okay. That's actually not bad. That's not bad. They're all leaking? Okay, okay. One of them held. One of them held. The one that didn't get the double snail held.
You know, this could be worse, guys. This could be worse. We're still doing all right. We're still doing all right. You guys could have probably pushed to five workers here. You don't got to stay on four forever. I might stay on five or six workers, though, until uh, post 10, realistically, because this is when things get a little scary. If we can get them to have shutdowns and then just leak automatically, it'd be easy clap. Um, I think he leaks here. Yeah, every one of them leaks here. Let's go. Auto sends OP. Yeah, 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 Tommy. Go forget to build somewhere else. Trash can ass. Every one of them leaked here. Let's go, guys. Let's go. I think Tommy's honestly one of the easier ones to, to face because he just dies to his forgetfulness every game. <laughs> How frequent do you forget to build, Joker? This seems like it's a quite a big issue for you. <laughs> Make sure you adjust your split so that the uh, strong side gets your uh, your boss. Just a heads up, everyone. I noticed. Okay, so you adjusted your split correctly. Achilles and uh, Makes also good. So we're fine. Oh, Green forgot to build this round after last round everyone else did. I don't know if my guy leaks or not. The Dragon Turtle survived for a while. Looks like a hold to me. It looks like I think Wave 7 is probably our next best bet. As a group, we can probably hit him Wave 7. Um... Be careful though, Make. You're probably going to get a big send next. Yes, sir. I'm going to stay overbuilt here because these next couple waves are kind of scary. Wave 8 and 10 are really our weakest waves as a group. Again, that 10 to, uh, 10 to 12,000 is your goal for wave 8 if you want to hold. I'm going to bank on the fact that my bot's going to forget to build here. Let's go, we did. Uh, 1,200, excuse me. 1,200. I don't think I really need to push workers either. Which ones forgot to build? Pink and yellow. Okay, so pink and yellow. Well, they'll give shutdowns regardless because the fact that they have just insane Mythium reserves all the time. Right? And so that's just kind of how it ends up working. When you get, like, massive Mythium reserves like they do... Um, it becomes a lot easier for them to, to have shutdown. Like, they should get a shutdown next wave, depending on how it goes. Um, because yellow and pink should have, like, 200 Mythium to send here. So they got 120 on the ground this last wave, right? I'm gonna overbuild pretty hard here. I'll have about 1100 for next. Achilles is probably dead. This wave. I don't really think we need... Yeah, look at... They all have shutdowns now. We really don't need to have many workers. They'll, sh they'll give us gold by themselves, right? Like, that's the big thing. 
Okay, blue forgot to build. Blue's pretty bad here, so that helps out. Uh, yellow got harb, so that's going to be, I think, too hard to get through here. Harb is pretty rough on these waves. There's a shutdown. It looks like Peli is going to get through green as well. Shutdown. Well, it's an extra 50 gold in total. Said, oh, I'm concerned for your mental health. My helmet is heavy metal. I'm looking at about 1600 value, value wave 10, which is, I think, a pretty safe number to be looking at. Just overbuild hard for 10 guys. We win on 10 probably. 10 or 11. We got hero as well, which isn't bad. Don't make it girth we build. Yes, exactly, exactly. Okay, my bot forgot to build. Let's go. That should be a pretty massive leak then on uh, on yellow. 1700 held the gate guard on 10. Okay, Joker, that's good to know. Fifty gold shut down a mine. They might just die here, depending on how this goes. Forty-three percent king health. They sure they actually probably survive here. In general, though, we're looking pretty good. We should have another three hundred to build here. So another three gate guards. I'm trying to be relatively informative with these because I do think this will go on YouTube. Um, so if you're watching this, I'm trying to give you guys the rough uh, estimate for um, for value numbers you should be looking for to try to hold certain waves. Um, if we end up beating them early, I'll try to walk through a little bit more of what I think. No upgrades on gate guards, yeah, yeah. Not worth it. Never worth it. So... Um, I'm thinking you're probably going to want to just try to stay super overvalued because the fact that they're going to just forget to build. And as these coming waves come up, um, you, you realistically want to try to just make sure you yourself hold, you and your teammates hold. Uh, so yes, last game, uh, which I probably won't post, we ended up getting about 1500 value and leaked to an ogre on 10. And so in this game, I'm making sure that we have well over the... The 1500 threshold. One of my teammates had um, 1700 and held a Ghost Knight Hermit on 10, and so I think 1700 is a, a relatively speaking pretty good number to look for overall. Um, Hero and Gate Guard should buff summon as well, yes. 23 stack Kingpin, let's go. So I'll have 1800 for next wave, should be fine. Alright, and they have pretty big shutdowns and they should, um, they should leak pretty hard here. They should leak pretty hard here. Um, I don't see any of these builds realistically holding on 10. If they do, we go like 13 or 14 on them, and we should be fine. We should just be able to long save into them. Two of them forgot to build. That should be enough. We'll see, though. Green and blue. Both of which actually had pretty good builds to hold. Or green and pink, excuse me. And pink, which yeah, both of them had decent builds to hold, so we'll see what happens. Shut down. Shut down. Okay, 125 gold shutdowns. Do I also get mine? Yes. Shut down. So that's 150. That's 200 gold to shut down. Beautiful, beautiful for us. Um,
I think we can go and bar go 14. I think that's not a bad play if they don't die. But I think they die. So the, the general consensus here, I think, is to go go for a, a longer starve, right? Go for a long starve after 10, um, because Tommy will just consistently basically snuff himself out. Um, and that's that's kind of it. The uh, the bots will snuff themselves out pretty hard. Gate guard only, proving to be just too powerful in a 4v4 scenario. Um, absolute uh, domination by our 4 stack here. Uh, gate guard OP. And that's kind of that. <laughs> uh, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. All right, another another four, another group of four.